Hey, are you ready for some hunting on the Tommy Wilcox Show? Tommy Wilcox Outdoors is brought to you by Alabama Credit Union. Feel good about your money. Louisiana Farmers Warehouse. Go by and see my good friend Daryl Foray pick you up a Mahenja tractor or one of his top leading mowers. Tuscaloosa Toyota. One price, one place. Glencoe Equipment. If you're in the Gonzales, Louisiana area, go by and see my good friend Ty Jervy. He has multiple tractors to pick from, as does mowers. Top Shot Deer and Turkey Mix by Faithway Alliance, Ortec Tractor and Equipment in Nabu, Alabama. Greg can handle all your tractor needs of any brand, along with some of the finest mowers in the industry. Nelson Glass, for all your contract and residential glass needs. Music courtesy of country icon, Hank Williams Jr. Hey folks, welcome to Tommy Wilcox Outdoors. I got Uncle Doyle Sanford with me today. We're going to be doing some old school fishing. Doyle Sanford from up there on, uh, what's that big hill up there, <laughs> up above north side? Phillips uh, Mountain. Phillips Mountain. Phillips Mountain. And I've uh, been knowing Doyle and his brother Charles Sanford a long time. Back when I played ball here, and uh, that's when we first met, we we become just great friends over the years. Uh, so Doyle, it's great to have you. You want to tell everybody how, what type of setup we got and all? Well, Tommy, like you say, we got old school today. We got a 16 or 14 foot cane pole. We got just a straight line, fishing with crickets today, and we're using the old uh, quill cork. You know, this is old school. You don't see these anymore. Yeah, you really old. don't. We found them in a, a store this morning. I didn't hadn't seen them in 25 years. <laughs> but Everybody done went to styrofoam. Yeah. We used we you know we used to make these. You make them out of <clears throat> porcupine quills or turkey quill. You know, turkey yeah. feathers. So they float good and they do a good job. They sure do. But How did Joel's deer season go this year up there on Phillips it, Mountain? It yeah. went pretty good. We didn't kill any sure enough big time deer, but we killed about three or four good wall deer. Yeah. What we consider good for this part of the state. So. And y'all still planting and just... Still doing it all time. Liming it, fertilizing yeah, it. Yeah, getting it ready. My, you know, I spend more money on these deer than my daddy did on the 200 <laughs> acres of cotton. <laughs> That's Deer true. Deer and the man. fish, getting them ready. Hey, and with you know, fertilizer cost this year, it's going to really go up. Look, it's going to take a cosigner to do it this year. <laughs> All right, so we're going to we down here at Swamp Whitetails in Brent, Alabama. A uh, beautiful place they've got down here at uh, Swamp Whitetails. We do a lot of deer hunting down here. They have a beautiful lake. So uh, Dole's down here with me, and we're going to try to. See if we can get y'all a, a bunch of brim, and who knows, we might even pick up a bass or two. So, y'all stay with us, though. Let's go get us some. Good man. enough, my man. All right. Oh, got one, man. Oh, this is just a little bitty perch. First one of the day, dog. It <laughs> ain't a big hey. one. Yeah, you don't even clean this one. You just throw it in the pot and, and eat, eat everything. We're going to get you some big ones in this, right? Come on, Come on in there. Well, that's maybe the first of many. Need a net? No, no net. But <laughs> now that's look at this. That's all right, ain't it, Yeah. Look at this baby. Boy, that's a big old. Hey, they still on the bed? Look at there. See yeah, that? Pen. That's an indication right there. <sighs> Maybe that's water not 
kind of bite me yet. You get a mess of them right there, Dolly. It, it wouldn't take many, would it? Nah. Huh? Make you a good fry, huh? Oh, hold on. Oh, big yellow. Big yellow. Big yellow doll. Look at that big old fat joke, huh? Bruiser, man, bruiser. This is what we are, just old school crickets, cane poles. Using the old quill off of porcupine as a float. Everything's old school today. I'm out here with Dole Sanford. We're having a ball. All right, Dolly, let's get out to some more. If there's a new mower in your future, you really need to visit the folks at Artec Tractor in Jasper. With brands like Bobcat, Cub Cadet, Gravely, Spartan, and Toro, they can help you find the mower to fit your needs. They also have a full parts and service department with factory trained technicians to support you after the sale. Located on Highway 5, just north of Jasper, on Facebook, or at artechtractor.com. Experience, selection, and friendly service are the reason customers keep coming back to Artec Tractor. Wouldn't it be nice if you could feel this good about your money, even after you grow up? You can with Alabama Credit Union. We offer easy, everyday banking and great rates on loans for real life. Plus, we help make the community stronger through initiatives like Secret Meals for Hungry Children. Because we're not just here to help with money matters. We're here for the things that matter to you. Alabama Credit Union. Feel good about your money. Dateway Alliance has been blending Top Shot Deer and Turkey Mix since 2009 in Gunnersville, Alabama. Top Shot Plot Mixes provide deer and turkeys a high quality, nutritional forage for both winter and spring months. All Top Shot blends are coated with a cellar growth to promote healthy seed growth and increase your crop yields. Please contact your local ag retailer or call Faithway Alliance for all your Top Shot needs. Hello, I'm Patrick Hall, owner and operator of Hall's Feed and Seed, located in downtown Mountville. This location is under new ownership, yet we still have over 100 years of experience under our roof. Here at Hall's, we strive to serve our customers and community for all your home, garden, farm, and recreational needs. We offer a variety of products from pet foods to highway blends to deer mixes. Come by and see us at Hall's Feed and Seed. Y'all come, come see us at Hall's Feed and, and Seed. seed. We at Louisiana Farmers Warehouse are proud dealers of the world's number one selling farm tractor, Mahindra. So when you're ready to invest in a new tractor, Louisiana Farmers Warehouse's friendly and knowledgeable staff is here to make sure your experience is outstanding. Choose any of the great Mahindra tractors from 20 horsepower to 125 horsepower and know that our certified technicians are here to support you for years to come. Call Louisiana Farmers Warehouse and get your Mahindra tractor today. Yeah, we got one here. Not very good. There's got to be little ones as well as big ones. These are appetizers, Lance. Good, he pulled good. He bees a little one. You know, sometimes it's just a lot of fun just going back to 30 years ago, doing it the old fashioned way. Yeah, even though with all the new technology, you miss that, but, but, uh, 
Just fishing with crickets is uh, a lot of fun. Dolly, what you got? I think I got another appetizer. That's yeah, right. pretty good size. Huh? He's pretty good size. Just right for eating. Just right. Nice and healthy. Really nice and healthy. There you go, Dolly. That's two for one, Lance. Same cricket. You get his money for it. Dark. Running on me, boys. Whoa. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. I'm a bad. Papa. Ow! He got me. Ooh. I'm only doing the doubles again. A little double. A little double time. Yeah. Walk up just ahead though yeah. and turn around and show him that. Things are looking up, man. Oh. Got really seen it now, too. I didn't even sit out good, darling. I didn't even sit good. Boy, he just threw that cricket. Not the biggest in the world yet. We haven't gotten to the big, big ones, but we will. They're here. He keeps these lakes lined, fertilized. Alright, while I get a cricket, let's take a quick commercial break and we'll be right back with you. Y'all stay with us. Hey folks, welcome back to Tommy Woolcox. Uh, we're down here at uh, Swamp Whitetails. Got my good friend Dole Sanford with me. Though, you know, I try to take kids every year. I know down at your farm, we've, we've taken some kids, handicapped folks, special needs. Uh, talk about the enjoyment of taking kids fishing, because that's kind of a losing, we're losing that, the kids of tomorrow, you know? You're absolutely right. We've almost lost a generation of taking these kids hunting and fishing. And hey, just like we've shown you today, you can be very simple with it. Cane pole, crickets, but try to take them to a place that they're gonna catch some fish, even these pan fish, because that makes all the difference in the world. A lot of these kids get taken fishing and they take them somewhere to a public place and they can't catch fish and this and that and the other and, and they go a time or two and they just kind of, well, I don't like fishing. But look, <laughs> you bring them out to a place like this, and there's places like this everywhere, uh, where they catch fish like we did today. And keep them interested because a, a child, a kid, you know, you got them, you got to get them some fish within, you know, 30, 40 minutes or they're going to they're gonna be, <laughs> they're that's gonna it, be, they're not going to have They're going to be running to banks and throwing rocks and stuff, but, you know, just like today, we come down here, even as, hey, seasoned, supposedly seasoned sportsmen, I had a ball out here this yeah. morning just with a cane pole and, uh, you know, crickets and, uh, but I think it's very important. And, you know, these kids have been on lockdown for two years and re restricted with this and that and the other, but take them out, take them out. And look, if, you, if you're not going to fish, just take them out in a boat and ride them around. But it's better to catch them some fish and, and they'll remember that. I mean, take pictures when you do these things. Take the pictures and, and hey, when they get up a little bit older, 
and even older, they'd show their kids and maybe do the same thing with their kids. Because you know, fishing licenses and hunting licenses are down drastically. And uh, we've got to get these kids away from the Wi-Fi and the, the computers and all these games on the computer and on their iPhones and get them in the outdoors and teach them how to catch a fish or, or go squirrel hunting or something like that. That's right. you know? And look, catch these fish and cook them. Yeah. yeah. You know, a lot of kids don't like fish. The reason they don't like them is they've never had them. <laughs> you know, and I ain't talking about a fish stick from, from a drive-thru. <laughs> no, that's, that's a McDonald's. I'm talking about real fish. Right. Where, like today, yeah. where we caught all these fish. You take them home and you dress them and you and you fry them, and it's a treat. And uh, you get these kids hooked on this instead of all the other things that you mentioned that's going on right now with social media, and it's just. Uh, it's just a, it's a difference maker. Yeah, it really is. And hey, while we're talking about, it, I appreciate you, all the things that you've done for the less fortunate over the years, whether it was hunting or fishing, we've seen them just have the biggest time in the world, yeah. an opportunity that they normally wouldn't have had. And I appreciate all. Well, there's a lot of people that. helping. You've helped in contributions to help us take people, and you let us use your farms. And that's a big deal because, like you said, these kids are, they have circumstances that's beyond their control. And uh, to be able to get them out in the outdoors, let them shoot a trophy buck or, oh, or yeah. shoot a turkey or catch mm -hmm. a bunch of fish, you know, that means the world to them. Dove hunting, squirrel yeah. hunting, rabbit hunting, all different types of things that you can do. Well. Well, let's, uh, let's hit back out in the boat and let's uh, see if we can catch some more fish. All right, but before we do, this is absolutely a magnificent place. I've heard of this place. I've never been down here, but I appreciate you inviting me down. Yeah, Swamp and, White Tales. And teaching you the old school, how <laughs> we used to do it up in the Sipsy River yeah. 70 years ago. Yeah, you know. and it's a ball, man. Hey, I appreciate it. All right, buddy. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Let's go get some more. What you got, Dolan? Good fish. Pretty good fish. Fat. It's a bluegill. Yeah, nice fish. Good and thick. These are off the bed and they're still... They're like I'm going to take them on the side, don't they? Yeah. Still in good shape. Look at me, darling. All right. I may mount this one, Tommy. <laughs> Let's not. You can get a bigger one than that. Now you hook me, nice. Tommy. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, Nelly. Oh, Nelly. Who used to say that, Keith Jackson? Oh, oh, no. oh, nearly gone. <laughs> I didn't feel like messing with him anyway. Y'all got a chance to see it. Look at Dolly loading up, doubling up. I go strictly by numbers, Tommy, <laughs> not size. <laughs> oh. I wanted to, I played with that when I was going to get a picture with it. Yeah. And I fiddled for it and let him get it. I'm not going to mess with him. There we go. Now when you... <laughs> Alright boy, calm down. Whew! Get you some. Whoa! Very good in there. There we go, folks. Calm down, son. Calm down, son. It's all right. Oh, boy. Folks, if you haven't done it in a while, pull you out the old cane pole, get you some crickets, and uh, get out here and try this. It's a lot of fun. 
and uh, less effort too. You don't have to cast and all that stuff, you know, but you get some, some big old nice brim in. Yeah. Wouldn't it be nice if you could feel this good about your money, even after you grow up? You can with Alabama Credit Union. We offer easy, everyday banking and great rates on loans for real life. Plus, we help make the community stronger through initiatives like Secret Meals for Hungry Children. Because we're not just here to help with money matters. We're here for the things that matter to you. Alabama Credit Union. Feel good about your money. When it comes to tractors, how do you get power without noise and smoke? I'll tell you how with the all new Select Track E25 electric tractor. This four wheel drive compact tractor pushes 25 horsepower and works perfectly for small farms. Depending on the load, you'll get three to six hours of runtime. Get a full charge in only eight hours. The E25 accepts all Category 1 540 PTO implements, including hydraulics. Find a local dealer at selecttrack.com. Over the past decade, car shopping has changed more than anyone would have imagined. That's why with our customer's input, Tuscaloosa Toyota developed one price, one place. How does it work? We give you our lowest price first. It's posted in the window of every car or just two clicks away at TuscaloosaToyota.com. It's the simplest, most hassle-free way to buy. One price, one place, only at Tuscaloosa Toyota and TuscaloosaToyota.com. For over 20 years, people have trusted our tech tractor for their tractor or construction equipment needs. With brands like Bobcat, Mahindra, and Massey Ferguson, our tech tractor can help you find the right solution for your farm or the job site. Our tech tractor has a full parts and service department with factory trained technicians to support you after the sale. Located on Highway 5, just north of Jasper, on Facebook, or at ourtechtractor.com. Experience, selection, and friendly service are the reason customers keep coming back to our our tech tractor. Right, yeah. Oh, there we go. <laughs> okay, son. Yes, sir. Uh... These suckers will get you, man, if you're not. Like he's getting me right now. Big one, Dolly? Not real big, no. Let me back up. Not real big. Not real big. Almost turning color. Uh -uh. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this week's show. I want to thank Dole Sanford Dole. As always, my friend, no, buddy, thank you. uncle. You know, I call him Uncle Dole all the time because he's got so many nephews and nieces and cousins and if you ever around up on phyllis mountain everybody's called him uncle dole uncle dole so everybody just calls him uncle dole but man as always i appreciate you coming we always have a lot of fun we've been doing it now for 40 years we have and uh have. i wish old charles was still here with us yes. so no doubt about so he can enjoy because he's the one that got me into these uh green trout and bath <laughs> Perch, perch, jerky. yeah, perch, perch jerky. jerky. He loved yeah. to catch these browns. No doubt oh about it. man! Well, thanks for coming, man. And, enjoyed uh, it. Enjoyed it. We'll do it again. Yes, sir. Thank you, Swamp Whitetails, for letting us come down. Uh, Y'all got a beautiful place down here, and folks, if you want to call them and give them a chance to come down here and whitetail deer hunt, I mean, it, it's a beautiful place Absolutely down here, is and nice. the food is. And the accommodations are just wonderful, man. So, and then when you got a little downtime, you come out here and wet a hook. 
That's right. So, and hey, let's don't forget our cameraman today. Yeah, Lance, Lance. Shores. He's, he's been with, he's been with me for he twenty years, man. And Absolutely taking is. pictures and all that stuff. Yeah. All right, buddy. Well, thank you, and uh, we'll see y'all next week right here on Tommy Woodcox Outdoors. Thanks for watching. Okay. Good. Up, loaded down, trucking on from town to town. Guns, bows, and a tackle box. Here come Tommy Wilcox. Hitting the water, hitting the woods. That Bama boy sure got it good. Always having too much fun.